Before we pray, we have to understand that Christians are called to resist and pray against the enemy's plans to prevent them from hindering God's purposes in their lives. The Bible teaches that the devil seeks to steal, kill, and destroy, John 10 verse 10. But believers have the authority to rebuke his schemes, Luke 10 verse 19. In Ephesians 6 verses 10 to 18, Paul instructs Christians to put on the whole armor of God to stand firm against spiritual attacks. Praying for the enemy's plans to fail aligns with Christ's victory over darkness, enabling Christians to live in freedom, fulfill their calling, and experience God's abundant blessings. Now let us pray. Lord, I meditate on Psalm 18 verse 32, that it is God who arms me with strength and makes my way perfect. I command every weakness in my life to be transformed into strength. I receive your power to overcome. Almighty God, I reflect on Psalm 91 verses 14 to 15, that because I have set my love upon you, you will deliver me. I command every enemy's attack to be reversed. I receive your love and protection in every area of my life. Father, I declare Psalm 121 verse 5, that you are my keeper. You are my shade at my right hand. I command every attack on my peace to cease. I receive your comforting presence as my protector. Lord, I proclaim Psalm 23 verse 6, that surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life. I command every spirit of negativity to leave my life. I receive your goodness and mercy in abundance. Almighty God, I meditate on Psalm 35 verse 28, that my tongue shall speak of your righteousness and of your praise all day long. I command every negative word spoken against me to fall powerless. I receive your righteousness in my life. Lord, I declare Psalm 27 verse 1, that the Lord is my light and my salvation. Whom shall I fear? I command every spirit of fear to be cast out of my life. I receive your light to guide me in dark places. Father, I meditate on Psalm 91 verse 7, that a thousand may fall at my side, and ten thousand at my right hand, but it shall not come near me. I command every attack to fall powerless before me. I receive your divine protection. Almighty God, I proclaim Psalm 3 verse 6, that I will not be afraid of ten thousands of people who have set themselves against me. I command every opposition to be silenced. I receive your boldness to stand firm. Lord, I reflect on Psalm 18 verse 35, that your right hand upholds me. I command every enemy to stumble and fall. I receive your support and strength to overcome every challenge. Father, I declare Psalm 55 verse 22, that I cast my burden on you, and you shall sustain me. I command every heavy burden to be lifted from my shoulders. I receive your grace to sustain me through trials. Lord, I meditate on Psalm 121 verse 3, that you will not allow my foot to be moved. You who keeps me will not slumber. I command every plot of the enemy against my stability to be thwarted. I receive your unwavering support. Almighty God, I proclaim Psalm 69 verse 1, that save me, O God, for the waters have come up to my neck. I command every overwhelming situation to recede. I receive your saving grace in my life. Father, I declare Psalm 18 verse 19, that you brought me out to a broad place. You delivered me because you delighted in me. I command every limitation to be broken. I receive your favor and enlargement. Lord, I reflect on Psalm 91 verse 4, that your feathers cover me, and under your wings I take refuge. I command every attack meant to harm me to be thwarted. I receive your sheltering presence. Father, I meditate on Psalm 35 verse 4, that let those be put to shame and brought to dishonor who seek after my life. I command every enemy seeking my downfall to be defeated. I receive your vindication today. Almighty God, I declare Psalm 23 verse 5, that you prepare a table before me in the presence of my enemies. I command every enemy to witness my blessings. I receive your abundant provision and protection. Lord, I proclaim Psalm 121 verse 6, that the sun shall not strike me by day, 
nor the moon by night. I command every harmful influence to be rendered ineffective. I receive your constant protection. Father, I reflect on Psalm 69 verse 30, that I will praise the name of God with a song and will magnify him with thanksgiving. I command every negative atmosphere around me to shift. I receive your joy and peace in my heart. Lord, I declare Psalm 18 verse 34, that you teach my hands to make war, so that my arms can bend a bow of bronze. I command every spiritual battle to turn in my favor. I receive your training and skill for victory. Almighty God, I meditate on Psalm 91 verses 9 to 10, that because I have made you my refuge, no evil shall befall me. I command every evil intention to be thwarted. I receive your shelter and safety. Lord, I declare Psalm 3 verse 5, that I lay down and sleep. I wake again because the Lord sustains me. I command every spirit of insomnia and unrest to leave me. I receive your peace that surpasses all understanding. Father, I meditate on Psalm 35 verse 10, that all my bones shall say, O Lord, who is like you? I command every attack on my health to cease. I receive your healing and restoration in every part of my body. Almighty God, I proclaim Psalm 91 verse 11, that you give your angels charge over me, to keep me in all my ways. I command every harmful influence to be removed from my path. I receive your angelic protection. Lord, I reflect on Psalm 18 verse 2, that the Lord is my rock and my fortress. I command every enemy's stronghold to be dismantled. I receive your strength as my foundation. Father, I declare Psalm 121 verse 4, that he who keeps Israel shall neither slumber nor sleep. I command every attack in the night to be powerless against me. I receive your vigilant protection at all times. Lord, I meditate on Psalm 69 verse 13, that I will pray to you, O Lord, in the acceptable time. I command every delay in my prayers to be broken. I receive your timely intervention in my life. Almighty God, I proclaim Psalm 91 verse 5, that I will not be afraid of the terror by night, nor of the arrow that flies by day. I command every fear to be removed from my heart. I receive your courage and confidence. Father, I declare Psalm 35 verse 1, that you contend, O Lord, with those who contend with me. Fight against those who fight against me. I command every enemy to be brought to shame. I receive your victory in every battle. Lord, I reflect on Psalm 55 verse 1, that I give ear to my prayer, O God, and hide not yourself from my supplication. I command every distraction in my prayer life to be silenced. I receive your listening ear and response. Almighty God, I meditate on Psalm 23 verse 4, that even though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil. I command every shadow of death to depart from me. I receive your rod and staff for comfort. Father, I declare Psalm 91 verse 7, that a thousand may fall at my side, but it shall not come near me. I command every attack from the enemy to fall to the ground. I receive your promise of protection over my life. Lord, I proclaim Psalm 121 verse 8, that the Lord shall preserve my going out and my coming in from this time forth and forevermore. I command every plan of the enemy against my travels to be nullified. I receive your guidance and safety. Almighty God, I reflect on Psalm 69 verse 15, that let not the water overflow me, nor the deep swallow me up. I command every overwhelming situation to recede. I receive your divine rescue and support. Father, I meditate on Psalm 18 verse 32, that it is God who arms me with strength and makes my way perfect. I command every weakness to be removed from my life. I receive your empowerment to succeed. Lord, I declare Psalm 91 verse 3, that surely you will deliver me from the snare of the fowler and from the perilous pestilence. I command every trap set for me to be broken. I receive your deliverance and safety. Lord, I declare Psalm 91 verse 9, that because I have made you my refuge, 
No evil shall befall me, nor shall any plague come near my dwelling. I command every sickness to depart from my home. I receive your healing presence. Father, I meditate on Psalm 35 verse 3, that I take up my shield and buckler and stand up for my help. I command every attack from the enemy to be deflected. I receive your protection as my shield. Almighty God, I proclaim Psalm 23 verse 1, that you are my shepherd, I shall not want. I command every spirit of lack to be cast out. I receive your provision in abundance. Lord, I reflect on Psalm 18 verse 19, that you brought me out to a broad place. You rescued me because you delighted in me. I command every confinement of the enemy to be broken. I receive your freedom and favor. Father, I declare Psalm 91 verse 11, that you give your angels charge over me. I command every spirit of fear to be silenced in my life. I receive your heavenly protection surrounding me. Lord, I meditate on Psalm 121 verses 1 to 2, that my help comes from you, the maker of heaven and earth. I command every source of help that is not from you to be removed. I receive your divine assistance. Almighty God, I proclaim Psalm 55 verse 22, that I cast my burden on the Lord, and he shall sustain me. I command every burden that weighs me down to be lifted. I receive your strength and support. Father, I declare Psalm 27 verse 1, that the Lord is my light and my salvation. Whom shall I fear? I command every spirit of intimidation to flee. I receive your boldness and confidence. Lord, I reflect on Psalm 91 verses 5 to 6, that I will not be afraid of the terror by night, nor of the arrow that flies by day. I command every attack, both seen and unseen, to be rendered powerless. I receive your complete security. Almighty God, I meditate on Psalm 18 verse 28, that you will light my lamp, the Lord my God will enlighten my darkness. I command every dark cloud over my life to dissipate. I receive your illuminating light. Father, I declare Psalm 35 verse 27, that I shout for joy and be glad, for your favor rests upon me. I command every spirit of despair to leave me. I receive your joy and gladness. Lord, I proclaim Psalm 91 verse 14, that you will deliver me because I have set my love upon you. I command every enemy trying to come against me to be scattered. I receive your deliverance and protection. Father, I meditate on Psalm 69 verse 18, that you draw near to my soul and redeem it. I command every chain of bondage to break. I receive your redemption and freedom. Almighty God, I declare Psalm 121 verse 3, that you will not allow my foot to be moved. You who keeps me will not slumber. I command every slip and fall in my life to be prevented. I receive your constant vigilance. Lord, I reflect on Psalm 18 verse 46, that the Lord lives. Blessed be my rock. I command every storm in my life to be stilled. I receive your peace in the midst of chaos. Lord, I declare Psalm 3 verse 3, that you, O Lord, are a shield for me, my glory and the lifter of my head. I command every spirit of shame to be removed from my life. I receive your honor and upliftment. Father, I meditate on Psalm 91 verse 7, that a thousand may fall at my side, and ten thousand at my right hand, but it shall not come near me. I command every attack of the enemy to bypass my life. I receive your divine immunity. Almighty God, I proclaim Psalm 27 verse 5, that in the time of trouble, you shall hide me in your pavilion. I command every threat to be hidden from me. I receive your shelter and safety. Lord, I reflect on Psalm 69 verse 1, that I am sinking in deep mire where there is no standing. I command every deep pit of despair to release me now. I receive your rescue and restoration. Father, I declare Psalm 91 verse 3, that you will deliver me from the snare of the fowler and from the perilous pestilence. I command every hidden trap set against me to be exposed and destroyed. I receive your deliverance. 
Lord, I meditate on Psalm 18 verse 34, that you teach my hands to make war, so that my arms can bend a bow of bronze. I command every battle arising against me to be won through your power. I receive your strength to fight. Almighty God, I proclaim Psalm 35 verse 2, that I take hold of shield and buckler and stand up for my help. I command every adversary to back down before me. I receive your unwavering support. Father, I declare Psalm 91 verses 9 to 10, that because I have made you my refuge, no evil shall befall me. I command every form of evil to be blocked from my life. I receive your sacred protection. Lord, I reflect on Psalm 121 verse 5, that you are my keeper. The Lord is my shade at my right hand. I command every form of heat and oppression to be kept away from me. I receive your refreshing presence. Father, I meditate on Psalm 69 verse 14, that you would deliver me from the deep waters. I command every torrent of trouble to cease. I receive your calming peace in every storm. Almighty God, I declare Psalm 18 verses 32 to 33, that you equip me with strength and make my way perfect. I command every roadblock in my path to be cleared. I receive your guidance and direction. Lord, I proclaim Psalm 121 verse 7, that you shall preserve me from all evil. I command every evil eye watching me to be blinded. I receive your protection in every area of my life. Father, I reflect on Psalm 91 verses 14 to 15, that because I love you, you will deliver me and set me on high. I command every spirit of bondage to break. I receive your liberty and elevation. Lord, I meditate on Psalm 35 verse 1, that you contend with those who contend with me. I command every enemy that rises against me to be scattered. I receive your victory over every battle. Almighty God, I declare Psalm 55 verse 18, that you redeem my soul in peace from the battle against me. I command every internal struggle to be resolved. I receive your peace that surpasses understanding. Lord, I declare Psalm 91 verse 1, that I dwell in the secret place of the Most High and abide under the shadow of the Almighty. I command every attack of darkness to flee from my life. I receive your shelter and security. Father, I proclaim Psalm 27 verse 1, that the Lord is my light and my salvation. Whom shall I fear? I command every spirit of fear to be cast out. I receive your courage and strength. Almighty God, I reflect on Psalm 35 verse 5, that let them be like chaff before the wind, and let the angel of the Lord chase them. I command every enemy pursuing me to be scattered. I receive your divine protection. Lord, I meditate on Psalm 69 verse 17, that you hear me and do not hide your face from me. I command every cry of distress to be answered. I receive your attentive ears to my prayers. Father, I declare Psalm 91 verse 4, that you cover me with your feathers, and under your wings, I take refuge. I command every form of harm to be kept away from me. I receive your comfort and safety. Lord, I proclaim Psalm 18 verse 2, that you are my rock, my fortress, and my deliverer. I command every fortress of the enemy to crumble before me. I receive your strength in my battles. Almighty God, I reflect on Psalm 121 verse 8, that you preserve my going out and my coming in. I command every journey I take to be safe and secure. I receive your guidance and protection. Father, I declare Psalm 55 verse 22, that I cast my burden on you, Lord, and you shall sustain me. I command every heavy load to be lifted. I receive your strength to carry on. Lord, I meditate on Psalm 18 verse 39, that you gird me with strength for the battle. I command every adversary that stands against me to be defeated. I receive your empowerment in warfare. Father, I proclaim Psalm 91 verse 11, that you give your angels charge over me to keep me in all my ways. I command every plan of the enemy to be thwarted. I receive your heavenly protection. Almighty God, I reflect on Psalm 121 verse 6, 
that the sun shall not strike me by day, nor the moon by night. I command every natural force working against me to be nullified. I receive your constant safeguard. Lord, I declare Psalm 35 verse 4, that let those who seek my life be ashamed and brought to confusion. I command every enemy plotting against me to be exposed. I receive your deliverance from all harm. Father, I meditate on Psalm 69 verse 16, that you answer me, O Lord, for your loving kindness is good. I command every feeling of abandonment to leave me now. I receive your love and attention. Lord, I proclaim Psalm 91 verse 15, that you will be with me in trouble. You will deliver me and honor me. I command every trouble to cease and leave my life. I receive your rescue and glory. Almighty God, I declare Psalm 27 verse 5, that you will hide me in your pavilion in the day of trouble. I command every trouble to be pushed away from me. I receive your safety and shelter. Lord, I declare Psalm 91 verse 3, that you deliver me from the snare of the fowler and from the perilous pestilence. I command every trap set against me to be dismantled. I receive your divine deliverance. Father, I proclaim Psalm 35 verse 6, that let their way be dark and slippery, and let the angel of the Lord pursue them. I command confusion in the camp of my enemies. I receive your heavenly intervention. Almighty God, I reflect on Psalm 18 verse 48, that you deliver me from my enemies. I command every enemy to be cast down and defeated. I receive your strength for victory. Lord, I meditate on Psalm 121 verse 3, that you will not allow my foot to be moved. You who keep me will not slumber. I command every stumbling block to be removed from my path. I receive your steadfast support. Father, I declare Psalm 69 verse 14, that I am rescued from the depths of despair. I command every spirit of despair to leave my life now. I receive your joy and hope. Lord, I proclaim Psalm 91 verses 9 to 10, that because I have made you my dwelling place, no evil shall befall me, nor shall any plague come near my dwelling. I command every evil presence to vacate my space. I receive your protection. Almighty God, I reflect on Psalm 27 verse 2, that when the wicked came against me to eat up my flesh, my enemies and foes stumbled and fell. I command every wicked plan to be thwarted. I receive your assurance of safety.